What is happening, guys? Cowboy here. Welcome back. It's time to make our way towards the end. So, fully upgraded Trinity Scepter. 207.6. S scaling strength. It doesn't get much beefier than this. Time you knew my name. There was a time when I held many titles. Men knew me by other names as well. But titles, fame, infamy, it is worthless here. On this island, Jarrett is my name. Envy is such a thing. A man envies his neighbor whose wife is very beautiful. The Lord envies a king who commands nobles. The king envies a god to whom all men must bow. And a god envies, the god envies what a god cannot have. I wanted so much from life. Satisfaction eluded me. And the things I prayed for, well, would you believe a god actually answered my prayers? These things, this life, this island, such is my reward. Fantastic power, a lifetime of servitude, and a purgatorial existence in this still place. The god of this island is the god that answers my prayers. His existence is one of insatiable lust for something a god can never have, to be born of light. He preyed on the greedy, collecting on the debts of kingdoms and countries in some mad, mad hope of collecting things he shall never have. Us, we are born of salt, bound by sanctuary. We are the eternally dead. This god, this demon, I want him to remain nameless. His lustful power is fueled by terror and infamy. Men at sea can fear the Kraken, but give this vile god no name. Go on. There's something I find funny. There's there's a uh... the voices for Deckard Cain and Bane are very similar. Both have that that kind of undertone that I was just speaking with, but I mean. Every, every time I find that guy, I give him what I would consider to be the Deckard Cain voice. But I just found it interesting. Is that people that were like, you don't sound too much like Bane. And it's like, sweet summer child, this is not Bane. This is Deckard Cain. The one who carries the Haradrim. All these... All these, these chitlins these days. Children that don't even know the legacy of Deckard Cain. Say, I think there's an actual sanctuary here. Let me just let me see real fast. Oh, never mind. This is the only shrine available in this area. As a note I just found. Well, in that case, uh, shit. That's not the horn I wanted. I wanted this horn. I need, I need like one more point in stamina, basically. Because I was doing the math, and I am uh, just a pinch away from being able to fast roll while wearing gloves. So, I'm going to have to uh, go on back to town and do that. Tree of skill. Let's see. Where's the horse? Got to be uh, somewhere along my path there. Perfect horse. That, I should be able to put back on some gloves. Oh, not those gloves. Uh, oh, not those gloves. What about these gloves? Okay, I can wear those gloves. Oh, 
Look how fast this thing swings. Which actually, I don't even think I might be able to to give. I don't. I think I can just take. Cause it doesn't really need the uh, the swing upgrade, you know. Like it swings. It already swings fast enough, so I might as well boost the damage. Considering the damage that's on this thing is like god tier already. Get a red wine. Dead. This should be fun. Final boss is weak to strike. And you go through the entire game and pretty much everything that you fight is uh, weak to uh, to slash damage. You know, there's very, very few bosses. Like, actually, pulling up, pulling up the list here, out of all the bosses we've killed, the very first one, the knight, he's weak to strike. Um, the Kraken Worm is weak to strike. Tree of Men is weak to strike. Uh, the Dried King. And this guy. That's it. Everything else is like elemental or slash. So, you know, there's a lot of the time. And I mean, enemies too. I mean, Christ. Do I even need to go into how many enemies are uh, resistant to our strike? But this guy, the final boss of it all. Pitiful death. Damn it! How do I... Shit! I feel like I have to be able to get up there, you know? There we go. Hard as shit getting up in this place. Was a mimic. Pearls. Nice. Another one. Pearls. That access to the shop. Oh no! Come here! Come here! these little sneaky sneaky little jumps man I know where we're at All right oh yeah there's that thing okay I 
actually, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna probably die. Uh, oh, oh no, 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 no. That goes. Here. This goes. There. Just uh, pop the bell. Go back. There we go. All right. Uh, so let's go down. Actually, it kind of looks like this whole area is just, um, there's a piece of candy over there that I want. It looks like this whole area just literally goes down and that's it. Like, I don't think there's, I thought there was something that I would fight here, but it's starting to look like that is not the case. It's looking like this is just, get that. Okay. Probably just go all the way down to Angry Bone King Man and, and I beat his ass. And that'll be that, because it's Angry Bone King and I am Big Boy. Builder of Giant Hamas. Really bad. Actually, no, it looks like there's another platform right there. It's through the door. Oh, yep, he's down here. Okay. Alright, so hammer. Um, I don't think he's weak to any elements. Let me see. Are you weak to anything? Mr. Uh... He actually has 500 resistance across the board to all elements. Fuck! I would not want to fight this guy as a mage. Um... God, do I have any? I kind of wanted to, like, put some holy paper on my shit anyway. I will just do this. We'll go hard on him. No. Nameless God. Oh, stop that, stop that, stop that, stop that, stop it, stop it, ow. Whoppa! That's satisfying. That's a pretty cool song, but he got booped. And, uh, the song ended. I mean, I do have, uh, one of the strongest weapons in the game. To be fair, this thing is beefy. And I was boosting its damage by 50%. It's what's in the well? Ooh, so I, I guess I take the helm and I become the new god, or I do nothing. Uh, fuck this island. Go down the well. Whee! What happens down the well? Anything? A hammer! I know it's like hard as, as hell to see. I can also barely see. Wait, I, I'm swimming? Swimming somewhere. Aaron Gold. Killing flesh, free from goal, free from jail, to splendid rest. Hi. 
nice. So looking up, it looks like there are a couple endings. Um, there's the salvation ending, which you get the three Devara's Light Iron Ones, uh, Stone Root, Fire and Sky, House of Splint. Okay, so you get a different poem at the end, depending on who you're part of. Bearing gold on failing flesh, because I was House of Splendor. Like, if I was Betrayer, it was Viceroy of our God of Blood, Splitting Strife in Lands Above. If you're the Caster thing, Stifling Flames and Sea of Ice, Looking Towards Eternal Sky. Strangled Roots of Blackest Sea, Sheds Chains of Steel till Vines Go Free, Wild Man, Steel and Stone, Rest from Sea for Iron Home. Angel Solace, Clasped Thy Death, Curse No Longer Gasping Breath. Born of Salt, Devoured by Sea from Icy Crypt, Deliver Me. Or there's a domination ending where you become the new lord of the island. This ending will not occur if you have not spoken to Scarecrow each location. This is the ending you're after. You can backtrack to the location you should have shown up to choose this. You'll have to speak to Scarecrow a final time. Take Helm. Uh, this will convert you into the new nameless god ruler of the island. You will obtain the overlord armor. What the shit? I should have done that. Overlord armor. What does that look like? Is that like the same armor he was wearing? It's probably too fucking heavy to, to be useful. Overlord set. Uh, it is his stuff. It is... Um, sold by the Nomad after defeating. Thanks for playing a new adventure. Wait, you goddamn right it does. Um, let's see. Possesses incredible power, blah, blah, blah. Sold by the Nomad. Guy in the Festering Banquet. Oh, so I can, after defeating Nameless God. So I guess I can... I had the set... Full set is automatically acquired and equipped. Um, in New Game Plus, if the player chooses the Dominion ending. It, it looks like it's not even heavy armor. Oh yeah, it's tier 5 heavy. I mean, it kind of looks goofy. Honest. Like, yeah, it'd be cool. This set requires drowned items for upgrades. Oh. Don't forget that you must buy the set in the playthrough you kill the boss. On all the armor sets. Drown Tome required for level 7 upgrades, so it's kind of pointless. Um, anyway, Minion. Let's see what those poems are. Burning cities bruised by war, praise not the three, I am the fourth. That's cool. Uh, for Devars, it's this pantheon of timeless gods shall tremble at the spreading dark. Iron ones, superstitions fleeting goals crushed and hewn on bloodied rocks. Stone roots are ocean black, invaders' blood, icy sea to wrathful mud. Keepers of fire and sky, power to mend searing cold sky above and dark below. House of splendor, love of gold, bitter heart, plunge the splendor into dark. Order of betrayer, heart of malice, sown in steel, meet the master's wicked will. So that that's it. You basically get a. Uh, to their dominion. I like how I wasn't even trying for the dominion ending. I just kind of got it. Like, I mean, well, I didn't get it, but I could have gotten it. Damn. It. Make your way. Place the altar. Despite everything, you'll live. Goddamn right I will. New game plus. Woo, let's go, boys. I am now God. Oh, man. You know, I, I really gotta say, going through this game not drunk um, was was vastly more enjoyable. I had a lot of fun playing this. I was like, I think that was part of the problem. Part of the, one of the things that makes drunk throughs so fun is that, you know, it's, it's usually the second, third, fourth time I'm going through a game. So, you know, I'm not, like, lost. I have an idea of what's going on. And, you know, I can I can thoroughly enjoy it, but... Ah, oh, damn it, I don't have my brains anymore. That would have been cool. I mean, I get why you don't get to keep them, but it would have been nice if you did get to keep your brains for New Game Plus. You could get all the goodness right at the start. I'm just going to kill the boss real fast just to see what New Game Plus is like. Stop that. I mean, I expect to just destroy its face because that's what we do. Oh, no, 
Oh, this isn't the boss. Get out of my way. Yeah, this is definitely this is definitely a good time. I mean, the mage playthrough. That's I'm doing that just as I have time for it. So you guys will never see that one. That's just you know me playing the game and having fun with it on my own. Uh, but the whole the gunblade run that that might be something that would be kind of cool to do. Health up. Not like it's gonna matter, but. Yeah, so, um, up next, um, for those that are curious, the next game on our list is going to be Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. Especially coming out of Salt and Sanctuary, I think that'll be a lot of fun to, to jump into, so. You just loop you a little bit. Oh, oh wow, he tickles. Let me show you pain! And I will say, they're not as, uh, like, I mean, we still utterly destroyed this thing, but it definitely was more resilient than I thought it would be. I figured I was just going to walk in there and be like, you're dead, sit down, and it would have instantly died, and it actually took, uh, took a couple boops to take it down, so it seems like the health pool in, uh, in New Game Plus scales incredibly well. Um... So as for Bloodstain, that uh, right now at least the plan is to just you know start it tomorrow. So that should be fun. Jump on in, and then uh, after we're done with that, I'm not sure where we'll go, but figure things out. Thanks for coming by, and I will catch you guys soon. Title.